What's up, you guys? This is Barry, Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my current subscribers and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel, all the likes, subscribe, shares, and um, support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link to the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. I do not publicly display how much you donate. Or your name for privacy and confidentiality purposes. Just saying. Okay, so I got some channeled in, so I decided to do this reading. Oh my goodness. Yeah, okay. Well, we're not going to use this deck. I got to get another one. So, yeah, okay. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was... Um, Someone's true colors is, is about to come out, uh, whether people around them want, want it to come out or not. Um, this could be you or somebody you're connected to, but somebody's true colors are about to come out, whether people around them want it want the true colors to come out or not. Uh, it could be you or somebody you're connected to. And then I heard someone is um, a surprise moving soon. It's going to shock the hell out of people around them. So um, that could be you or somebody you're connected to. So someone's true colors are about to come out, whether people around them want them to come out or not. I feel that could be in a workplace environment, a family environment, a neighborhood environment, a community environment, a ball team environment, a social environment, um, however that resonates. But some kind of true color energy coming out in some kind of two plus environment is what I'm feeling. Um, this could be personal, it could be professional, you, it could be you or somebody you're connected to. Um, and then someone is moving surprisingly, um, and I heard it's going to shock the hell out of um, a lot of people. So I'm thinking their neighborhood, their neighbors, um, their family, their friends, their frenemies, uh, co-workers, etc., etc., etc. You plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates with you. Resistance on the bottom of the deck. Number 25 could be a very significant number in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. Number 25. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible jersey number. Um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Number 25. Resistance. Held back for a while, but it's about to happen. Okay, I heard held back for a while, but it's about to happen. So this could be you or somebody you're connected to, but somebody held back for a while, I think either showing their true self to people um, is what I'm feeling um, for the first situation. And for the second situation, I think you, um, you've probably been um, working in secret. I'm thinking you've been building yourself up financially in secret, uh, maybe getting your credit together or maybe paying. Um, I heard you're moving unexpectedly. So maybe you, you've you been working in secret in some shape, form, or fashion. You've been manifesting financially is what I'm feeling. Or for some, you could have just come into a payout or settlement or um, an inheritance or a will or something of, na of that nature and you've come into some kind of money um, and you're about to move. Um, some... Some, I feel, you've been growing, working in secret, manifesting financially in secret, um, is what I'm feeling. A particular Pisces is about to pass away soon. It's about to shock the hell out of a lot of, a lot of people. They are secretly very ill. They're not telling anyone. Oh my God. Whoa. So that could be the resistance energy too. Secretly. I heard very ill. But so ill they're about to pass away. I didn't hear what they have that's going to make them pass away. But um, they're very stubborn, very resistant to telling people that they're ill. Um, and I heard they're secretly about to pass away. Um, I heard it's going to shock the hell out of a lot of people. Um, but it's probably because they're not telling anybody they're so ill. They know it inside themselves. They know they're ill. Um, 
whoever this Pisces is, it could be a masculine or femme Pisces. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or if they've been hit with Jupiter charts. But they're very freaking ill. They're very ill, and um, they're resistant to get medical care, medical attention, um, resistant to uh, get some help to heal themselves. Or, I mean, maybe it's a terminal Ill illness. I'm not sure. I don't know. Well, it's about to turn into terminal. Um, I feel it might. Uh, yeah, I think it is a terminal Ill illness, and I'm serious. Resistant, I think, in the past to get some treatment, some help, some medical attention um, to tell people what's really going on. I heard it's going to shock the hell out of a lot of people. So they have been stubborn in the past to receive medical care or attention or treatment or something. Holy goodness. It can be a masculine or thin Pisces. They could have five Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, mid, or Jupiter charts. That's too many. Release reverse. Number 27 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 27. Be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible jersey number, etc., 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 number 27, um, release reverse. This Pisces wanted control, 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 control. But it has manifested back in the form of severe illness for them. And it's just going to get worse. Oh, Lord. I'm pulling this Pisces in very strong. Whoever this Pisces is to you, um, they could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, been hit with Jupiter charts. But I heard they wanted severe, severe, severe control. So they could have wanted severe control over you. Or severe control over somebody else, but they want a severe control in some shape, form, or fashion. But it sounds like they're about to pay for it with their life. Um, this is wow, this is strong. Holy crap. Uh, I heard it energetically backfired on them in the form of medical, medical. So, I mean, they are severely ill. Um, whatever in the world it is, they are severely ill. Hmm. But they're not telling anybody they are. Resistance again on the bottom of the deck. That's them not telling anybody they're ill. Um, oof. Sovereignty upright. Number 41 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 41. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible jersey number. Um, number 41. This is going to be very, very, very beneficial for you. Very beneficial. This person has been nothing but a nuisance in your life. Intuitively, you know this. Oh my gosh. Whoa, this is so strong. So I heard this person has been nothing but a nuisance in your life, wherever you are. Uh, this Pisces is connected into your life. So if this particular message resonates for you, the first two may resonate. This one may resonate. I'm not sure. You have to plug in your life however it resonates, if it resonates for you. One message may resonate. Two plus may. None may resonate. But this particular message with the Pisces about to pass away, um, you are connected to them in some shape, form, or fashion. They might be your spouse. They might be a controlling partner. Uh, they might be a third party. They might be a situationship. They might be a family member. They might be a neighbor. They might be a coworker. They may be... Um, there's somebody you are connected to in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, you might get utilize services from them in some shape, form, or fashion. I mean, I'm not sure, but you are connected to them in some shape, form, or fashion. But I heard this Pisces, basically, um, they wanted severe control, but it's basically about to boomerang energetically back on them in the form of death. I mean, death. That's the biggest form of control there is, is death. But it sounds, this is karmic um, justice here. This is karmic 
not karmic justice, but karmic, um, the actual karmic cycle is what I'm trying to say. They wanted severe control over you, but the spirit, spiritual realm had different plans. They had different plans is what I'm trying to say. So now it's energetically boomeranging back on them, um, if that makes sense. So sovereignty, um, this is the death energy here I'm feeling. I heard they wanted to control you so badly. They wanted to control you so badly um, or control a situation or both, but you are ener you are energetically connected to this Pisces, whoever you are. I heard it's going to benefit you in huge ways. Um, and it's going to give you control of the situation in some shape, form, or fashion. So for some, I feel you might be legally married to them. I feel you might be legally married to them. I feel you, um, or you might be, um, or you might own a business with them. You might co-own a business. You might be legally married to them. Um, or something of that nature. Um, somehow you're going to gain control in some shape, form, or fashion. With this Pisces passing away. Um, whoever you are. Um, for some, it might be your boss. And you might get promoted. For some, you might be a spouse. For some, you might... Um, yeah, that's what I'm feeling. But somehow, yeah. Or you might have been gang stalked by this person, gang stalked or um, bullied or harassed, and with them passing away, you're free of the bullier or, har or harasser or gang stalker or whoever. Um, I feel it could go several ways. So you're going to have control over your life. Definite control over your life. Freedom, finally. You have been secretly miserable. Okay, I heard definite control over your life, freedom, finally. You've been secretly miserable. My God, whoever this is for, this is terrible. So you've been secretly miserable and you're about to have freedom over your life, finally. So you're going to have control over your life. Control over your life and the Pisces, Lord have mercy. Um, uh, sovereignty in that situation is... Um, Death angels coming after them. And I'm serious. Um, wow. Oh, crap. Number 41 can be a very significant number. Number 41. With the, this passing of the Pisces, it's about to cause huge, huge, huge energy shifts and huge events to happen soon. Oh, my Lord. Okay, I heard with the passing of this Pisces, it's about to cause huge, huge energy shifts and huge um, things to happen soon. So, this Pisces passing is about to be very, very, very significant. Very significant in um, your life if you're connected to this Pisces. and You're energetically connected to them. Um, well, you're a family member, a spouse, a partner, a third party, a co-worker, a neighbor, or something of that nature. But um, you are energetically connected to them. Um, but it's about to affect your life in a positive way, if this resonates for you. It's about to affect your life in a positive way, give you control over your situation, your mind, your time, your maybe money for some of you guys, um, maybe some assets. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, um, but control over your life. I heard they have been just been controlling the hell out of you. They have been controlling the damn hell out of you. Um, that's why I feel for some it could be a committed partner or a spouse. Um, and I'm serious about that. Um, and I hate to say that. I hate to say that nobody should ever try to control anybody in a relationship or a, um, um, or a marriage. Um, that's why I'm very, very afraid to get uh, married again. And I'm serious about that because I was in such a controlling marriage for so long. Um, uh, I, I don't, I don't want to be married again. Um, and I, I committed for me personally, a committed relationship would be fine. But not a marriage because of my past. Um, but everybody's different. Everybody's different. So you plug it in how it resonates. But control over your life. Control over your life of freedom, um, happiness, um, um, positivity here. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Your health is going to improve greatly. Okay, 
say, I heard your health is going to improve greatly. So your health is going to improve greatly. Whoever you are, I didn't hear a sign on who you are, but you're dealing with Pisces, I'll tell you that. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or so, mid-haven, Jupiter charts. Whoever you are, um, it could be a masculine or feminine Pisces, but they have been controlling the ever-living hell out of you. And they love to control others, and you know this. And they love to control others, and you know this. So they not only love to control you, um, but they love to control others too. But um, the death angels are about to come after them. Um, that, it sounds like they refuse to get medical, proper medical treatment in the past, um, or refuse to go to a doctor to see what in the world was going on, or something of that nature. Um, or for some, it could be sudden, like MI or something of that nature, possibly. Um, I didn't hear any of that. Um, but it might be, uh, you plug it in, how it resonates. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.